Hey guys, we're in Rocky Mountain House, Alberta. We're getting ready to have a whole day of adventure in the Rocky Mountains, so we thought we'd do a video about how much you can see in one day. We're on our way to the mountain. First stop of the day, Abraham Lake. This lake is really famous in the winter time because of what? Frozen bubbles <laughs> that you can see underneath the frozen lake. Yeah, from what we've heard, it's, it's methane gas. And so I guess it's rising up. It must be coming up now, I don't know. You don't see anything, but in the winter, yeah, it freezes and you can actually see below it. It looks very beautiful. But I think it's equally beautiful now in the summer. The water is so clear and it's nice and blue turquoise color. Look at this beauty. According to Matthew, the secret is to get a nice flat rock. So let's see if it works. <laughs> no, doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, and I didn't know I was a pro at this. So. Kind of a flattish rock, as flat as you can find it. And when I throw it, I throw it like this so it spins and try to hit the water, but it hits it like this. Very easy. As that you can tell, it's very easy. Let's see. Oh, it shot! Oh, I was like 12, wasn't it? I had. No, no, no. I think it was actually. Uh. That, was, that was maybe a record. You just witnessed history right there. <laughs> We just saw a black bird just on the side of the road. Look. We're back here with Rocky's Heli. We were with them in the winter, but we love it so much that we're back now for the summer. Yeah, we've actually never been here to take a flight in the summer, so it's going to be totally different. But we're also going to be landing and going on a cool little hike to a waterfall, so we're looking forward to this. This is called a juniper berry. Kind of looks like a mini blueberry. But this is what they make gin with, so. It's amazing, it tastes exactly like gin without the alcohol. As you can see, the views are amazing here. It's a beautiful canyon, and what's cool about it is it really is just a five minute hike and tops to get here, so really anyone can do it. Well, we're back again at Rocky's Heli Canada. We took a little break to go on a hike, but they said they had extra room on their long one hour flight that goes actually over the ice fields of the Columbia ice field. It's supposed to be super spectacular. We've never done it, so we came back. 
This 55 minute tour truly blew us away. We flew by so many incredible mountain valleys and jaw dropping mountain peaks, all the way to the Columbia Ice Fields and the Athabasca Glacier. It was so awesome to see all the snow in late July, as well as turquoise colored lakes. We even crossed the continental divide between the provinces of Alberta and British Columbia. There's really no better way to see the Canadian Rockies, and there was no better way to end our tour than with a rainbow over Abraham Lake. Oh, oh my, my god! god. <laughs> no, these were even better! Yeah. That was insane! We just saw a grizzly! I know! Our third bear of the day, two black bears and one grizzly. It's the first time we've ever seen a grizzly just randomly on the side of the road like that and he really didn't care that all the vehicles were stopped. I know, he was just focused, munching in his berries. Yeah. So there you go, only one day in the Rocky Mountains here at the Icefields Parkway or around there yeah. and you can see a lot of Even awesome just, things. Like the drive itself. Yeah, everything is beautiful. Drive.